what's good ambitious gang how's everybody doing man look we going to fucking what mcdonough mcdonough georgia headed up there now man i'm going to go meet with uh a really big inspiration you know behind my truck stuff um that white bow tie man if y'all don't know him man please go check him out you know go check out some of his videos you might some of you people might be already subscribed to him, especially if you're already into the trucks and stuff. Um, but yeah, we're going up here meeting with him. Uh, I'm gonna do like I guess just get like a little review of his truck, also some of the other trucks that are around. Uh, they're having like a big meet tomorrow up at um Southern Tires, I think that's what it's called. That's where we're headed actually. So, um, I'm pretty much just going up here to chill with him for the day. And uh, I heard he got a flamethrower though. Yeah, but he got a flamethrower. Mm -hmm. So I'm, I I don't know if I'm gonna mess with it. I probably won't, most likely, because I don't fuck with fire. But um, it'd be pretty cool to catch some of it on film. Uh, but yeah, so we're headed up there. I got my brother with me. So uh, hey man, hopefully this this is uh you know make this into a little movie. You dig what I'm saying? Bread gang, ambitious gang. That's his thing, you know. And uh, hope y'all enjoy it, man. Don't forget to like that. Uh, go ahead and smash that like button. And if you're not subscribed to the channel, man, go ahead and smash that subscribe channel. Subscribe to the channel and uh, join the ambitious gang, man. Got the kids in the back. So we finally made it down here to uh, McDonough, McDonough, Georgia, and um, <clears throat> kind of sat and chat with uh, with that wild bow tie man. Real humble dude, real cool guy. 
um, probably about to mess around with the flamethrower a little bit and uh, show off some of these trucks that y'all seen um, as we was coming in or whatever. But yeah, I just, <clears throat> Jesus, we ate some, uh, what is it called, chicken run? Chicken and run. Chicken and run. <clears throat> I give it a seven out of 10. I gave it a six and a half. Six and a half? He tough, man. He tough on him. I'm just saying, bro, like, the chicken sandwich, like, it was basically just tenders with bread. If I wanted that, I'd have went to Zaxby's. Zaxby's, man. You would have got that Zaxx sauce on there. <laughs> exactly. With a, little, with a little lettuce and tomatoes and pickles and stuff. Bro, they didn't give me, they didn't even put it on, they didn't put the pickle on the sandwich. They put the pickle on the side. <laughs> but, like I said, man, we just ate there. Now we just kind of chilling in the truck before we get back out and start filming some more stuff um yeah it was all right i ain't gonna say it was the best thing because i definitely don't have better than that um other than that man it's a it's a couple nice trucks up here though we got uh we got this one right here in front of us which i think is real clean it's a tahoe look like it's like a 2017 maybe Maybe a little bit older, uh, but sitting on uh, some KG ones, 26 by 14s, maybe 35s. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, 35s. But yeah, that's all we got right now. To the excitement shit start happening. Cause we the only squatted truck in the freaking city. Yeah, we definitely are. <laughs> There's no squatted trucks out here. <laughs> and uh. <laughs> And my truck is literally the only one that I've seen. <clears throat> but yeah. So uh, I'll put the camera back out as soon as we start doing some stuff. All right, so I'm in the back of uh, Southern Tires. That wide bow tie. Hey, no cap, bro. Just, hey, this shit wide as hell. I'm going to keep it a whole stack. Like, look at this. Come on now. And what, uh, what, what are those? What we got? 37s. They look so wide though. Is he running spaces on that? Um, no. Well, yeah, I think he got two inch spaces look like, maybe. Might be not, it might be. I have to ask him when he get back. He just actually went to go grab him some something to eat. Um, but y'all see it, man. Got my baby in the back. Got some new things coming for her as well. Um, <clears throat> I don't want to really say it, but next week i give it two weeks prior two weeks maybe uh my truck's gonna look totally different i'm um, changing up some stuff on it um they got this nice ass dodge ram that i'm i'm fucking with it hard uh, longhorn yeah longhorn right here larry Running and some thirty sevens on there. Twenty fours look like nice ass G. Hey, I ride this G. That'd be like something I'd definitely take out in the mud and shit. But um, my little brother's trying to get like work out a little TikTok deal with them or whatever. <laughs> I don't know if they really gotta do it, but if they do, that'd be pretty cool. Um, but I mean, shit. Hey man, we enjoying it down here, McDonough, McDonough, Georgia. Uh, Y'all know me, man, coming down here <laughs> into the uh, into Georgia. This this deep, man. I got a couple of my buddies that live somewhere near around or close by and shit, but. Hey, right now we just really enjoying the lifestyle out here for a little bit and then uh, around about next probably three hours or so we're going to get up out of here, head back to uh, Florida and um, yeah man. Yeah, no shy, bro. I'm not. <laughs> My man got the flamethrower out here. What's going on, bro? Not much. What's 
going on? What you been putting together, man? Something that you kind of you probably want to see. <laughs> what is it? It's a flamethrower. I'm okay. in the military and we don't even make them. Okay. <laughs> we like to party. You good, man? I did too when I seen it. I ain't even a horror fan of my life. Let me borrow it. He said that uh, he's got kids and his neighborhood won't let him use it. So uh, he said, hey, you guys make YouTube videos, right? Yeah. And I was like, yeah. He said, well, do you want a, a flamethrower? And I'm like, yeah. So here we go. Okay. It's almost exactly how the conversation went. Gotcha. <laughs> very, very nonchalant. Now I got a flamethrower. I need to record, damn it. Mine ain't charged up to record. My phone about dead. Can't really get any better. Bro, I've never like seen one in person. You about to today, guys. <laughs> Bro with me again. Well, I'm with him. I'm gonna say, yeah, you with me. <laughs> you driving back home, though. I'm gonna let you know that. Oh, boy. But it's gonna get real out here, man. Go that way, now. Don't go that way, man. Oh, shit. <laughs> Hey. No. Hey, no. Hey, that off pretty quick. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, yeah. And it is it's not like a you know just I mean it's more I'm like open for something a little bit bigger and better. But but wait, I mean, wait, 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 wait. You can't really you can try it too. You want to try it? Who? I'm going to let you try it. You're going to let me try it? Yeah. As long as on camera you say, you know, I'm not liable for, for anything. I mean, it wouldn't be your video. I mean, I'm going to film. Wonderful. <laughs> Later, but it wouldn't be your video if you didn't try it. Just point it away from you. Just press the button. Just hold it down. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna catch something. Hold it down for a second. Yeah, yeah, that's hot. Yeah, yeah, that's hot. That's hot. <laughs> oh man, that's so much fun though. That is. You see, at, at first I was super excited just to shoot flames, and now I'm like, well, what can I shoot flames at, or what can I? How's it gonna escalate from here? You know, what can I do with the flamethrower now? Well, down in Florida, you just get a bunch of firewood and just make you a bonfire with it. <laughs> As a kid, I took the, the you know, the, the uh, hairspray and the flame and did it like that. This is like, yeah. yeah that one right there. This is next level. Let's go to my man, Comfort. Just hold it down. I'm not, all jokes aside, I was a little nervous. I was a little scared. But it's not just really not that sound. When you read the instruction beforehand, it makes it sound so much worse. The instruction to caution this, caution that, explode this, it just, it gets real bad in the instruction. But you know, you just throw some gas in it, click the button, and you're good. But now I'm like, well, you know, can I ride down the road and shoot it out of something? Or <laughs> what can I do? I'm always trying to, you know, bigger and better things, right? Yeah. Do it out of the back of my truck or something. You want to do it? Come on, stop playing. You're here. You drove four hours. Shoot the damn flamethrower. <laughs> I'm just a cameraman. I, I'm getting paid to do this. <laughs> Yeah, don't you? Ooh. Come on. Man, I shoot, it. Bro, I shoot big guns. You camping. Y'all gotta go and get it. You gotta say it's worse than what you've done, man. Yeah. You done play way bigger and better things. I don't know about better, but bigger, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, you, you just can't help but have fun when you're doing that. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. That was free, hey, too. Don't you, don't you go to a real fight with right now? Uh, so, if you, in the park. <laughs> if you have, so they recommend the gas, normal gas, 100% gas burns off quick. If you want to like actually burn stuff, half gas, half diesel. So you walk into somebody's oh. house, half gas, half diesel, it's all over with. It's over with. They might get a couple shots off, but even if I'm dead, you burn. Yeah, I'm just up here thinking if you were to bust up in a meth lab, you know, just. Yep. <sighs> Let it up, let I don't it. know if you want to go in a meth lab with that because <laughs> hey, the whole house might be gone. I'm going to be honest. Wait, let me, get, let me get back on the TikTok camera. Go ahead. Go ahead. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. They say not in the way. <laughs> Okay. Uh, 
I got to ask you this question, man, because I I always hear you say it, and I want to ask. I'm an open book. What made you come up with Bread Gang? Bread Gang. So, when I start when I started YouTube, I um, to be honest, I started YouTube two or three years ago. I didn't really think I'd get anywhere with it, to be mm -hmm. 100% honest with you. Um, I had people that used to tell me they didn't think I'd hit uh, a thousand subscribers, and to be honest, I didn't think I would either. You know, I thought I would, yeah, but I figured it'd take a long time. And I um, I'm already got a rag back here. What the hell? Um, so I've never been a, a big fan or subscriber. I don't like that term. You know yeah. what I mean? It makes it it makes it seem like you're bigger than people or you're above people. Trust, I and get I, that. And I really don't like that. So I watch a lot of uh, YouTubers, and some of them come up with names for the family of subscribers that they have, right? Mm -hmm. And I was like, that's definitely, you know, what I want to do. Make it a family family kind of vibe, you know, that kind of thing. Right. I went to, uh, do you know who Dalton Bertrand is? The Bertrand 850. He's got a big orange Duramax and a Lamborghini. I think so. Lives in Panama City. Uh, huge shout out to Dalton. He's the one that got me into YouTube. Um, him and Amor. Amor probably never see this stuff. Um <laughs> I went down to Panama City and we did some off-roading videos. If you've seen my intro or outro, you've seen me in the sand. Yeah. It was those videos. And around that time, remember the Squidward meme? Yeah. That, uh, it was the you know, Squidward's all coked out and like shriveled <laughs> up. And it's like when you, oh, you've you got two hours of sleep, but you got to go to work. Uh -huh. and it says, let's get this bread. So that was the, the, the popular meme in the group chats I was in. And um, we said, let's get this bread like 10, 15 times in that video. And it had just become the thing, you know, for me, it just became my saying at that point. And it took me a couple months, and I finally had realized, you know, I need a name for my subscribers. This is turning into something, and just bread gang seemed to fit. Cause let's get this bread was was my saying. Yeah. And it just it just kind of as soon as it's one of those things, you know, you say it for the first time, you're like, damn, that's it, you know. And I've I've done a little bit of bread gang merch. I'm not a huge merch guy. Um, I need to get into it at some point, cause I know there are people out there that want to show love and Bro, you know want to support want to support your boy, but. Um, if you don't have your own people that you go through or whatever, there is a uh, website that you can go through and you don't have to worry about nothing. It's it. What is it? Uh, it's called Teespring. I've used them before. Um, and I'd, actually, I had a clothing line that I did for a little while. It's called Southern Ties. And mm -hmm. I still have it. I just kind of, to be honest, I put it on the back burner for now just because, you know, I love, I, I really above anything else. You know, I've done consulting. I've done the merch. I've done the clothing line. I've done a little bit of everything. And I, to be honest, I've really at this point just fallen in love with making content really that's I really all that. i'm here for at this point i love to make content i like to film stuff i like to have a good time i love the process i know some youtubers that don't like to edit there's nothing wrong with that you know some you know i'd love to have a cameraman at some point full time too you know i just can't do that right now but he's I'm, not he's not actually my cameraman he's I just love, my he's I my little people to, you know hold the camera yeah he's my there, but he's I just, my little brother he was bored and i told him i said just ride with me i said i'm gonna go do a video yeah. video what up no but i just i love the grind i love the grind i love waking up Knowing I got content to film today, knowing that after work I gotta go home, take care of my five dogs, and then edit for a couple hours. You know, I love the grind, you know what I mean? Yeah. I wake up, I'm excited to go to work every day, I'm excited to, you know, put in the work. I mean, I just, I love it. I have a good ass time. And, you know, hopefully, hopefully it translates yeah. to videos, and especially once people come up here. You know, it's kinda, it's kinda slow today, so there ain't much going on, but we always find something to have fun with and, you know, and, you know, make something out of nothing, you know what I mean? Hey. Man, I, I I feel that a lot too, cause I don't I don't like the whole subscriber thing either, man. So for me, we the ambitious game. So okay. it's ambitious. We're going after everything that they told us Absolutely. that we couldn't have when like we was that. growing up. So that's yes. my thing. There's a there's a barber in Atlanta. His name's uh, Vic Blends. Uh huh. Um, and something he said the other day is, um, um, we've already won because we're not supposed to be here. Exactly. I mean, big, big blends is, you know, he's a fan. He uh, cuts uh, basketball players' hair. I watch him on TikTok. Baby. Yeah. Yeah. So he does, he's, I mean, that's that's him. I've never met him. He seems really cool. But he said, we've already made it because we're not supposed to be here. I mean, right. that's how I feel. I never thought I'd get this far. So if I never do anything else past this point, I mean, I've gotten way farther than I ever thought I would. Yeah. So I'm happy. But as long as I can wake up and, you know, make some videos and get a, you know, get a couple views, I'll be happy. Okay. Hey, man. And for me, I guess... I never thought I'd be actually into this, but having the the, the wife that I have, man, my support system is crazy. You gotta have, you gotta have that. She, uh, I, I worked my ass off for, we've been together for nine years, I worked my ass off for seven years, and she told me when we first got here, she was like, she's gonna retire. And I thought it was bullshit. And at the age of 28, she, uh, uh hey. my birth, like a month after my birthday, 
she uh she texted me, she's like, you push. That's like, gold right there. Damn. I, was like, I was like, you pushed it. She's like, no. She's like, I got the account. That's Don't a, worry about it. God damn. Yeah. And for the last two years I've been focusing on this and then so now we kinda I mean you got you got a family here. Any content you want, you know where we're at. You know, especially because I go down to Tallahassee once every couple of weeks. I don't like to go back, to be honest. But I'm all I'm, I've been traveling a lot recently, and you know, having having great people around you is, is, is really important. That's a blessing. That's that's huge. I'm happy for you. That's I fucking. Was, I fucking that's love goals right there. Shit. Really? His little brother just jealous, trying to be like him. It's okay. My wife called me. I was literally, I was literally at work too. She texted me like, hey, "What were you doing? Where'd you work?" I was so um before I was uh I was doing construction. Left construction, went to warehousing, left warehousing, started doing roofing. And so you were really putting in work. Yeah, man. bro. I done, so like any hard job that you think about besides mechanic work, outside work, like underground utility, all of it, bro. I done done. Dang. And um, Cutting trees and all. Yeah. My dad owns a tree company, so That's I cool. worked with him. But when she called me, I was working at a bake shop, a smoke shop. Because so it was just like, I was getting to that point where like, I wasn't doing enough at the bake shop that I worked at. Overpaid, which I mean, you know, and at the time, like going through a rough patch with money and situations, but it's like, I can see So, you gotta, you gotta, have you, I don't know if you've ever said this on your channel. Please explain the conversation with your boss that, hey, quit, you know? So, I would have been real nonchalant about it. I would have walked up and said, hey, look, just wanna let you know. Bye. Well, with real my, with my boss, I can say it's my boss that at the time, he was really cool. So like he knew what I wanted to do because that's the only reason I came there. I came to the vape shop to work there and I wanted to start streaming and playing video games and stuff. So um, pretty much I was working there full time, but at the same time he would let me all be bad at least time for me to get home, to get a set up, get my stream, get food, and be ready. Hell yeah. And um, I think I was working, I worked there for about a year and a half. And uh, when she gave me that text, I, I went to the back office for him and I was like, hey, um, just let you know, uh, today's the last day. He's like, what you mean? I'm like, well, he said, you know my wife. He said, Sammy, he said, Sammy can't, uh, she doesn't text me. She said, everything's good. He said, I can leave you. She's like, I don't have to stress. I don't have to wake up, coming here, stressing about, you know, dealing with rude ass customers. Because, I mean, you get them everywhere. But yeah. She was like, yeah, you can, uh, she told me I can leave. He was like, is this what you want to do? You know you don't work all your life, so you know going home, are you gonna be able to sit home? And I was like, yeah, I can do it. You know, because now I can put forth the effort on doing my content. You know, making sure I can get my videos up for YouTube and being able to stream every day and spend more time with my son. Like, I can't really pass that up, right? Yeah, but I mean, you can't. That's that's and I was that's like, huge. That's I told huge. him I was like, you know, if I don't take it now, I feel like I'll never do it. Thank you. <laughs> hey, that's hey, brand, brand new tires going that's already. Business, bro. <laughs> that is good. He <laughs> make me want to go get me a Camaro now. Trade my truck in. <laughs> that is so crazy. Oh my god. This is a big this is a big right here. Can I can I do my Yeah, you can oh, go so about yeah. We don't fuck around over here. Oh I am. Oh are you gonna do it too? 
Oh my god. <laughs> Don't make no sense. No way you go big here again for the second time. I'm trying to mess up. I didn't do shit. Don't put the word. I had to track and call on. Jesus. Hey, boy, it go down in Southern Tires. Hey, hey, it, it go down. It go down in Southern Tires, boy. It go down at Southern Tires. I ain't burning mine, I'm sorry. Nah! No shot, G. That's that's part of the game. Part of the game. Oh yeah. Bro, I got a new little feature, bro. I had to look down the road, put some stars in the city. I saw that. Yeah, we got it. Yeah, we got it. Oh, we got to get on. You got the stars in it? Right. Put a thousand in there. I got thousand. That's yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. I got I got four fifty in mine. Four fifty. But yeah, I'm going. So yeah. No. Nah. There you go. Why you put 450 in there? Well, because that was just the start of it. But I'm about to put 1200 in it. About 1200. Don't miss this. But I got. Uh, I put most of my money in my sound system. Say it again. I got. I put most of my money in my sound system. I got a crazy box that I built on the bed. In the Carolinas, though, ain't you? Yeah. Yeah. So you see my type of trucks? Did you squat yours? Yeah, mine squatted. The black one. <laughs> but I'm not even from up there. Okay. I'm from Florida. Yeah. What made you squat it? Man, I don't know, bro. I guess being around the culture of all of it, yeah. and you I, seeing them, I, man. I ain't gonna lie to you. I hate, I told, I told them in the video, I hate squatting trucks. Oh, I know, I seen it. <laughs> I seen the video. It looks good, though, bro. I ain't got no problem with it, bro. I just would never do it with mine. Yeah, bro. It looks all right, bro. See, I like that right there, though. I like this right here. This is fire. Oh, the Kodak? Yes, I like that. That's fire. Oh, yeah. And I got the custom floor mats. Oh, yeah. All throughout the bed. good in this bit, too. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, this bit here. And then I got the... All right. You want to go first? Okay, let's go. Flip the knob, yeah. That's literally it. Flip that button and point it forward. I meant to burn my can. Huh? He said he wanted to burn the can. Yeah, the can I had on the ground. I forgot what I was doing. Good. Good. Yeah, yeah, just hold it. Good. We're not going to get you in trouble. There's no distraction. Real tight. Flip the red switch up. You gotta hit the little power button on the left side. Up. Give it about five seconds. And hold it down. That's it. Yeah. I promise. Yeah, you're good. Yeah. You're good, yeah. <laughs> We're all getting covered in gas right now. I love it. You can't see the, you can't see the mist coming back on you. I wouldn't, I wouldn't spray it back and forth though. <laughs> hey, that's all I did right now. <laughs> he, he turned it off. <laughs> he turned it completely off. I did. 
here, bro. Come on, Jimmy. I know you want to do it. Bro. Come on, Jimmy. We're here. Can I get all over these again? No, no, no. <laughs> No, because I, I, I'm thinking about buying one on the ride home, I'm going to be honest. For real? Yeah. Hey, I'll give you the website. All right, bet. <laughs> I'll give you all the info you need. Don't do it, because he's actually going to get it for real. We're getting pyromaniacs out here. Bro, that's ridiculous. Like, that's... That ain't nothing I think I'm going to get it. When we film the video this weekend, we're going to go side by side, get yeah. all muddy and shit, yeah. and then we're going to play with the flames over. Yeah. And we're going to have a good time. Bro, don't catch on the fire, bro. Oh, it's on the left side. Yeah. You're running out of gas now. You don't want to do it while you're here? No, I'm good. Okay, <laughs> look at you. <laughs> yeah, you about to be my thumbnail. Hey, look, they shoot it. That's what I'm saying. They shoot it twice and they put it down. They're like, all right, I'm good. <laughs> hey, I'm about to take a time today. I'm good. <laughs> for real. Hey, I need to film this truck before you leave, though. Huh? I stuck one of my wheel lights the other day. On my way back from Illinois. God damn, bro. Can't have nothing nice. <laughs> nothing nice. All right, ten four hours. All right. All out here. All out here. Too damn many. Too damn many, right? Bro, <laughs> Too damn like many. Four subs in the back, bro. I'll open the tailgate for you. Alright. Hey, bro. There you go. Bro. And then you got subs in the, in the truck, too, in the box, bro. That's OD, bro. This is box, bro. Hey, you talking about. Oh, my man's got the matching Yeti cooler. That's swag. You with the box in the back? Yeah, the whole thing. Hey, you're so good, right? How you feeling right now? Crazy. I love that. All the fun steering wheel. You're about to give me one of these. Do I get so much heat about those from older people to be like, why you got that girl's stuff? And I'm like, man, I like it. You got the, uh, the lights on. Ooh. Dang. Oh, it's actually got the, like, the multi colors. It looks like. Candyland. From a squatted truck person, you're in the squatted truck game, right? I guess you could right? say that. I don't consider myself in the squatted truck game. I'm just Alex, right? I'm a little bit of everything, right? Reps or replicas? Reps or replicas? They flame me in the comments for calling them replicas. Call them reps. <laughs> I mean, that's just. I was wrong. That's just what they. That's just what we call them around. Our, I was our wrong. Room. I now, was we'll wrong. The whole thing. I was wrong. I was wrong. <laughs> Say I was wrong. <laughs> hey, but for real, um, uh, there, there's one video that I posted. If it hits 500 likes, 04 tracks is going to drive down to McDonough here at Southern Tire, and we were going to squat my truck, and we were going to squat the Tahoe on 26 by 16. So if y'all if y'all have not seen the video with me and 04 track, it's at like 450 something likes. We need less than 50 likes. Y'all go show some love on that video. Me and 04 track did a collab. 500 likes. We need 40 likes. I'll squat my truck with the four inch spacers and we'll squat the Tahoe on 26 by 16. Right, Tahoe. Stop playing. We you will do it. Good when it was squatted out. Man of my word. You look real good when it was It squatted. did look good. I've been posting throwbacks on my Instagram. <laughs> that shit looked good. So stop playing. All right, y'all. So, man, y'all seen it, man. We had some fun with the flamethrower. Uh, seen the Camaro do a crazy ass burnout. 
Man, it was all in all, it was a good day. Uh, right now, me and my brother are headed back to the house. Uh, says our ETA right now is 846. So, headed home. Got a long drive ahead of us, another four hours. But it was all in all enjoyable, man. We had a good time. Good hospitality from them, man. Huge shout out to that wild bow tie. Guys, very humble, man. Really good dude. Um, all I mean, just all around, man. It was, it was a good day. Um, but yeah, once I get to the house, uh, just check back in. Let you guys know that we made it home safe and everything. And uh, like I said, man, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. And uh, please go follow him, man. Go follow him on Instagram. Uh, I will be linking his Instagram and his YouTube channel in my bio. So. Y'all make sure y'all go subscribe to his channel as well. Join the bread game. You know, and uh, y'all know what it is.